Hello everybody, and welcome to XCOM Enemy Within The Long War. This is XCOM Enemy Unknown with the Enemy, Enemy Within DLC, um, and with The Long War Modern Story, which makes everything an absolute ton harder. So I'm really quite excited for this, I absolutely loved Enemy Unknown, loved Enemy Within when that came out, but I haven't got around to trying uh, the uh, Long War mod yet. So yeah, let's just get right into this. That's not good. Anyway, enough of that. Uh, right, let's start by choosing our base location. I am going to go for... Uh, Africa, I think. Just for the extra funding. It's quite nice, and it's quite a big continent. So you don't have to worry about getting satellites all over it. Let's go with that. We're dropping you just inside the Egyptian border. Okay, here we go. First mission, straight away. Uh, so as I said, this is Enemy Within, uh, the Enemy Within DLC for XCOM Enemy Unknown, and we're also playing with the Long War mod installed, which basically makes everything quite a lot harder in general. I just thought we might be safe, cool. Just stack oh, no, everyone no. up behind him. Yeah, it makes everything a lot harder in general. Generally, if you're used to playing XCOM, you might get a little bit screwed by this I mod. That's the idea anyway. Fingers crossed everything might go alright, but I'm going to take everything super Got cautiously it. and you know, just be very careful until we make contact. So you're just going by the basic pattern of uh, playing hard XCOM, which is just to get ev one person, the first person you're going to move is always going to be the one who moves the furthest. So I think I'm going to move him, ooh, it's not really much good cover here, that's for sure. Maybe it would have been better going over here. Um, I think I might want to check down this way first if I can. But there's not really an easy way to get there. So what I'm going to do is move him up to here. We might make contact up front. Now we're clear. Cool. That's all, that's good. That's good. Okay. So essentially, if you use the first guy to go as far as you want to move in that turn to get to where you want to see. On then if you have way. everyone else following his footsteps, then you can't trigger any more movement because you've already checked that that pass clear and no one's going to see anything. Other thing to note is that you shouldn't use your second um, action straight away because then if you That's do accidentally make contact somewhere, then you've still got everyone to react with, either to get them into cover or take a shot, whatever there might be, rather than just sticking them into where watch as soon as you move them, them having them kind of stuck there. Okay, we're all good. So stick everyone into where watch again. Here's some contact coming from that side. That's kind of what I was hoping for, if I'm honest. Ah, they've run running to my sights. Awesome. That definitely makes me easier. Ooh, two sectoids and a drone on the first mission. That's kind of sucks. Uh, right, so I think I want to get... Hmm, can you make it to there? Yes, you can. So I want to get you up there first. Seeing as you're going to be able to move the least. Um, you four really need to get in some better cover because otherwise you'll just be completely screwed. Um, I don't really want to move this way, because odds are there could be enemies over there. Yeah, let's get you over here. Because so long as they don't have direct line of sight, they won't be able to shoot him, so it shouldn't matter that he's not in cover. All right, who can I take a shot with? I can take a shot with you on that drone. Um, so yeah, cool, let's go for that. 48% chance to hit. Uh, worse because it's flying, fair enough. Actually, your aim's pretty good. Nice job, dude. And you've got a laser sight, awesome. A 48% chance isn't great, but, eh, worth taking all the same, I suppose. If you've got a shot, no you don't. What I'm going to get you to do is go on Overwatch, in case they move closer. And same with just about everyone else. Because they won't be able to shoot me until they come closer. Now, you've gone on Overwatch, that kind of sucks. And you have also gone on to Overwatch. And the drone is going over there. Alright, you, you do that. Ah, he's running to my overwatch. Awesome. And it takes him down. Sweet. Nice job, sir. Good job. I have to say, I'm, I'm really amused by the fact that they've all got... Shut the fuck up, Dr. Valor. Uh, I'm really enjoying the fact that they have re um, red clothing. That's something I always do with my rookies. I always give them red shirts. Because, well, they're expendable. Okay, so we're going to take a shot with you first and see what happens. Uh, you've got a 48% chance there. That's not bad. Deal with that. Ah, bad luck. It's not your day today, is it? Then I'm gonna need to burn off their Overwatch if I can. 
So, I think what I'm going to do is get you over you here to run over to this point and hope to God that I don't trigger any more enemies if there are some. But if I do, we'll deal with that when we get there. So you're going to dash over there and hopefully not get murdered by Overwatch. Go on, can you do it? Taking the shot and missed. Good, good. There's one burned. And the second one. All right, nice running. That Miss Jessica Henderson, good job running. Very nice job. And now you've flanked them, which is very good. Okay, so now that Overwatch is burned, I can move up a little bit better. I think maybe I should try and get you up to here. Again, I'm cautious of alerting enemies over there, but I'm not, I've am not. i not got a lot of options. I need to get more people up there that can actually take a shot. And also, you flanked them over there, so you should get a good shot off on them. That's 69 and a 69. Well, let's go for the one in full cover, because he'll be easier to hit. Well, easier to hit for everyone else. Oh, shit, I did a ship. It's easier to hit for him. If he's in full cover, it'll be harder to hit uh, for anyone over here. So it'd be best off taking him out first. Ah, oh, I do not like where all this cover is. Alright, the run away. Not close enough to trigger my overwatch, but getting to better cover away from my flankers. Taking a shot, and they've missed. Alright, good, good. You're running right away until you can't shoot anymore, and you've probably gone on Overwatch, which kind of sucks. Realistically, I wanted to hopefully be able to get one of you up further there. I think I'm going to try and take this guy out first. Ooh, that's not good. That's a terrible chance. Ooh. Oh, I could... Well, yeah, that shot's useless. There's no point in taking it. So I'm going to move you to here, so hopefully no one will be able to see the enemies. At well, least you shouldn't have a... Yeah, you can't see her anymore, which is good. It sounds bad, but it's good. So I'm going to overwatch all them. Hopefully they should run, run into my line of overwatch. Uh, not, yes, they did. We got one of them. That was the idea. I want to bring them down here where I've got my cover. I don't want to move on them too much. But they're being smart. Ah, you've got him an overwatch shot. Very nice. Yeah, he's running right over. He's come straight onto the open. And he's running back. That's good. Means he's not on Overwatch. But the other guy still could be. Ah, I really don't want to just run up on them. But it might be the best thing to do. Fortunately, I can't get into cover from that dash. Can you? You can. But you'll probably get your ass handed to you. Ah, screw it. I'm just going to try popping them off with uh, the shots that I've got. I think that's my best chance. So let's take a shot with you. Oh, you got it. You actually managed to hit him. Nice job. Very good job. And the rest of you are going to stay on Overwatch, I think. Uh, yeah, let's get everyone else on Overwatch. Maybe they'll run back down here, because I'm not seeing a good alternative to handling this, really. Run back into your corner. Great. All right, yeah, I'm going to dash him up there. Hopefully, we'll be able to get eyes on. Actually, no, here will be better. Here's much better, actually. Yeah, let's do that. Yep, one of them was on Overwatch. Possibly both of them. Not a surprise, but because we're running, we get a nice bonus to dodging it. Only one of them was. We're good. I think what I'm going to do is control it with gratuitous use of grenades. Uh, how far can I throw a grenade? So that's sort of one, two, three, four. Yeah, should I be able to make that? Okay, what I'm going to do is move him up to here. Heading out. That'll be good. Now you've got eyes on them. And... Oh, God, I can't hit them from there. Oh, that's so bad. Not without hitting my own guy, anyway. Shit. I think my best bet would be, get, would be to get you back behind cover. You get back in there. Fortunately, can't overwatch in this turn, but yeah, we'll deal with that. Uh, all right. Yeah, let's get everyone into overwatch. I'm really sorry, dude. Please don't die. You were a brave man. Oh, God. Oh, Fuhrer resisted the panic, and he did very little damage to him. That's good. You've moved into cover, but avoided the overwatch, which kind of sucks. And you've overwatched again. Okay. Ooh. Ooh, maybe I can use a grenade with her. But I'll need to kill that overwatch first. So, let's get you to do a mad dash to over here. Um, this is basically an all-or-nothing attempt now. I'm going to get you to dash all the way up to here. Ten four. Come on, you can do it. You're dashing, so you should be able to miss. 
Oh, good job, good job. Good run, good run. And, oh yeah, it was only the one on Overwatch this time, so that means we're good. But that means we should be able to get you up here now, and we should be able to take him out with a grenade. Failing that, at least we'll have a half-decent shot. And we have our grenade shot. Excellent. Throw a grenade, take him out. Boom! Shut the fuck up, Dr. Barlin. Ah, okay, it's telling me exactly where the enemies are. So, it seems like they're coming from up there. So actually, we've got some okay cover around here that we can probably use to our advantage. What was that sound? What was that noise? Okay, we're coming from up that side, so let's get our front and center. Hmm, it's not the best cover, but it will certainly do. So let's see if we make Moving contact with this, We're and we game. did. Sure, Another two sectoids and a drone. Oh, three sectoids and a drone, okay. Okay, this isn't so bad. We've got actually a very nice shot on him straight away. Um, so I'm going to take the shot first, just to know what we're dealing with. See if we can take him down. And we did. Nice shot. Nicely done. You're going to mine meld, okay. Cool. So that means I should probably go for him. Uh, I know in the original, well, in without long war installed, that would kill uh, both of the enemies. The, the one that did the mine melting and the one that is mine melded. But I think it works a little differently in long war. I think it just does damage. But either way, we still want to try and take out the melder. Alright, let's move it with Walsh first. And I think what I'm going to do is move it to this half cover. And see if I can take out that melder. Solid copy. You actually might be able to pull off an amazing grenade here. Uh, not quite. Actually, well, maybe. You, you can take out both of them with one grenade. So that's good. So that can be our backup. But, yeah, if we can avoid using grenades, then that'd be nice. So I'm going to take the shot with you. See if you can make it. Oh, nice shooting! Very nice shot. That was beautiful. <laughs> one shot, two kills. Perfect. Well, seeing as that's a guaranteed kill with a grenade, I'm just going to run these guys straight out into the open, see if they can crack a shot off. Because, you know, save using the grenades if I can. Oh, and you made the kill. Nice job. Very nice shooting, sir. And the mission is still not over. Shit. <laughs> I was kind of hoping it would be. You hear it coming from right up by the, by the chopper. That's fine. Aha! We've made contact. I figured that might happen as well. Eh, no shots in the overwatch, but what can you do? But they should hopefully get in cover relative to these guys. And they have. That's looking good. Because these two, well, the one over by the chopper, we should be able to hopefully get a guy that could would maybe up here. That would be quite good, actually. Hmm. Yeah, I can't quite get, quite get you into that full cover, which is kind of a shame, but what can you do? Um... Let's put you onto this half cover here for now. Oh, hello! You little bastard! You sneaky little muffin! <laughs> what the hell are you doing there? On Overwatch, no less. Did you, I'm guessing they heard me, I suppose. But you've got a wonderful flank on this guy now. You should be able to take him out. Yeah, nicely done. Very nicely done. Okay, cool. So that's that one taken out. So we've just got these two left, hopefully. I really should have been paying attention to how many was. Um, okay, and you guys are going to start the door breach. And hopefully be able to get into cover there, maybe? Hello? Yeah, you can get straight into cover there, that's awesome. So let's run you into this full cover. Ah, bloody overwatch, shit. Phew, hit and miss. These enemies really suck with the overwatch today, but I'm not complaining. Uh, what am I going to do with you? Actually, I'm going to run you to over here for a nice flank. Boop, boop. Yeah, flank both of them, nice. Uh, let's take a shot at the mine melder, see what we can do. Oh, good shooting. Very nice shooting. And that did quite a bit of damage to him. He's only got one health left. That's nice. That's very nice. Okay, you've gone into cover and you've hunkered down. That is awesome. That essentially means that he cannot shoot me because he's not on Overwatch. So I can just run Miss Jessica Henderson right up here and get in his grill. Ah, slight problem though, she's run out of ammo. But that's fine. That's why I've got a pistol. And he only needs one damage, so should be fine. Run you right up here to get a nice flank on him. Hey alien, what's up? 
Death to you in the face. Alright! Alright, didn't lose anyone. One injury, I'm happy with that. That came out a lot better than I expected. Commander to the research labs. Commander to the research labs. Okay. So first things first, let's get a research task up and running. What are we gonna go for? Um hmm. I think we should go for alien weaponry perhaps. I can't remember what Xenobiology unlocks. I know it progressed the story, but hmm. Uh, let's go for Xenobiology to start with, I think. I realize our troops have to put their own survival Oh shut up, Dr. Valen. If they have to use explosives as fives, then they bloody well will. Uh, I can buy stuff from you and get a sort of shotgun. Ooh, in the place of a pistol. Cool. But more importantly, I'm really going to need some satellites. Um, yeah, let's just straight up build a satellite uplink. Which will. Which is one satellite plus one capacity for every two uplinks constructed adjacent to one another. So we get two for us. Cool. So, yes, let's build that right there. Build quickly. Let's build quickly, dude. Commander to mission control. Commander to mission control. Okay, it would take 21 days. Time to build 11 days, but it requires. 100 books more and 10 melds. Okay. Oh, okay, that's kind of cool. That's, that's nice to have. So you've got that option if you've got a bit of extra cash. But now we're going to go for standard. So let's build construction with that. And let's get two satellites. One and two. And wow, that costs. Okay, so it costs a hell of a lot more plus the 10 melds, but it does it in a half time. Okay, uh, let's submit all of that. Cool. Commander to mission control. Uh, I've got 444 left. Cool. Let's go and have a look at our barracks and view our soldiers. Alright, let's go and see what Central actually wants. Really? You were shouting at me to go to mission control for all this time just so I could scan for activity? Seriously? Alright, well, I suppose we'll do that. Scan for activity, what have we got? Cool, our Stingray missiles are done. So they're gonna. They should do more damage against more heavily armored targets, Commander, I think. We're detecting Ow, a new good contact. job too, because we've got a Much UFO contract. Than anything we've previously encountered. Ooh. I recommend we scramble our best equipped fighters if we're going to engage that ship. It's a large size, but it doesn't say whether it's armored or not or anything. Um, I think I'm going to scramble... Uh, yeah, let's go for one with Avalanche, I think. If they'll do more damage, we won't get through armor as much. And go defensive, balanced, or aggressive. I'm gonna go for balanced, I think. Let's see what happens, I guess. <laughs> come here, you alien scum. Alright, come on, you can do this. Closing on target. Wow, that's a very square looking UFO. Come on, come on, you can do it, you can do it. Do it. Three, two. Oh god. Ah, lost it. Damn it. And he got very damaged in the meantime. Can we scramble again? Contact yes, detected. we can. Cool. Well, it seems to do okay, actually. Uh, so I'm going to get Raven 2 up here. Try and take it out again. Definitely want to shoot this thing down and have so many cool stuff, like resources and stuff, that we could probably use. Alright. Come on, you can do this. Go to a vault. Oh, We're damn! Intercept was shot down. Shit. Contact That's not detected. good. Alright, let's try the guys with the Stingray. Balanced again, I guess. Yep, skip past the Oops. Oh god, what are they? We've picked up multiple requests for assistance. Abductions in progress are marked on the hollow globe. Aircraft lost radar contact with the target and returned to base. Oh, okay. So we lost that UFO, that's a shame. But we've now got some million abductions to deal with as well. In Nigeria, okay. Oh, get 80 bucks for it, that's pretty good. Um, seems like this will be a pretty easy mission, so yeah, let's get right on it. Okay, so let's go and do this with our new brand spanking team of rookies, who I'm not going to learn the name of because, well, they're red shirts. Commander, Says it all, really. They could quite well die. Contact. Yes, I know, I realised that before. Alright, let's do this. Another team of rookies against some hardened alien scum. 